She is a Year 12 student from Tweed River High and is a part of the Titans for Tomorrow Girls Academy. Ladies and gentlemen, please put your hands together for Michaela Riley. I would like to acknowledge the traditional custodians of this land and pay my respects to elders both past and present and extend that respect to other Aboriginals here today. I am Michaela Riley and I am an Indigenous U12 student at Tweed River High. I was asked today to speak to, about my personal view on Rugby League and what Titans Girls Academy brings to my life. Rugby League to me is about community and a sense of family and pride. I see the happiness and camaraderie with your teammates. It's a sense of haven, a release for our youth life and in general. I've grown up in Tweed Heads my whole life and I was brought into the football community. My grandfather, Jeff Walsh, played for Tweed Heads Junior Rugby League Club, then for Coogeon Leeds. Managed at South Tweed Rugby League Junior Club and Belamble Seniors. My father, Brian Riley, played for South Tweed Senior Rugby League and this tradition has led on to my brother, who now plays for under 14s, South Tweed Ospreys. And he's now in Group 18 representative team and has also completed in New South Wales Aboriginal Knockout. I myself have recently played for Tweed River High School in a fun day organised by CRL. I volunteered for South Tweed since 2012, assisting with registration of players, canteen, scoring and timing, strapping of ankles and hands, distribution of clothing to all players, administration to, of the club, and a club mascot known as Kayla the Koala. I do this along with my mum, Teresa Walsh, who is a first aid officer and a registrar. Three weeks ago, I had an opportunity as part of the T for T Girls Academy to meet the Senator of the Northern Territory and Minister of Indigenous Affairs, Honourable Nigel Scullion, to be able to speak to a federal minister about a, promoting a program that supports the success of a young Indigenous females in education and in community is something I'm very proud of. The Girls Academy has helped me gain determination to be a stronger leader for the next generation of Indigenous youth. I am more confident about my self-identity and that I am who I am and no one can tell me no. Um, since being in Year 12, I have had 12, uh, three major projects that go towards my HSC mark. On the last day of term, I had to hand in my Aboriginal Studies major project, which is worth 40% of my HSC mark. And that was a family tree on my family, my dad's side, the Rileys, and the story of my great-great-grandfather, tracker Alexander Riley. Without their help of Kimberley, Spencer, Tweed River Heights ALO, and the High Performance Centre, I wouldn't have been able to do my major in peace and quiet and without the fear of knowing that someone was wrecking my major. For those who don't know what the HBC, High Performance Centre, HBC, is, it's where girls can go study, do the assignments, debrief with Kimberley, and it gives us a sense of belonging and the comfort of knowing that there is always someone there to provide us with one-on-one -on -one time, which we crave for our success. I did ask the girls on their thoughts of T for T. The overall, overall consensus is that the workshops have helped the girls understand more about their culture. As many of them didn't understand or know their hardships due to... From, for Aboriginal leaders, the social and moral obligation that comes with community leadership is lifelong. Those who lead, who have authority and must care for and look after those who come behind. Thank you. What do t events like today mean to you? Um, well, I'm Michaela and I'm from, U from Tweed River High in Year 12. Um, today means a lot to the, myself because I do do a lot with league. And it, today was to show um, the commitment that Titans have to Indigenous youth and the upcoming of the Indigenous youth for the next generation. Um, and I really enjoyed today because it shows that even though it is a game for boys, there is a lot of involvement with the, for the women and that everyone respects the women for what they do. And yeah. And how important do you think it is for um, women and children to get involved in rugby league? I think it is very important because without the mums, I don't think that they would be able to do the things that they do. And for children, it's a safe haven for them for, from their lives and it gives them the connection that, and the feeling that they belong.